Hello everyone, welcome back to the Mystery Channel 33. I'm here to help solve more missing women, shooting and men cases. We are here to break the codes if we see any. We are here to see where their bodies are located, if they know. And we also here to see if they alive, deceased, body suited, change your ethnicity or misidentity. Y'all already should know who's involved, the white supremacists, the African Americans, and the immigrants. So let's begin. This is about a young woman named Look, Lasmina. Y-A-Z-M-E-E-N Williams, 31-year-old New York woman found fatally shot, stuffed in bag. Okay. I know I already told y'all this. This is the little game they play, okay? Um, my grand my granddaughter, I found my granddaughter like this. She was stuffed in a suitcase, but her vagina was out and mod and multiple means of pay to have sex with her in the bag, okay? Um, when I was pregnant with my son, Junior, I just got the urge to go in this alley one night. And I went in this alley and I found, I found my daughter, my granddaughter. So I went, I hurry up. I didn't know it was her though. I just found a suitcase, you know. But, and then I grabbed it. And then some man came up behind, after I grabbed it. He was like, you supposed to pay, you supposed to pay. And I just ran off with the bag, you know. I went off the suitcase and stuff. So they doing that with these young women, okay. Lasmina Williams, 31, lived in the Kipps Bay neighborhood on the east side of Manhattan, according to police. Her family called her a young, beautiful girl. She was about to begin a new job at the New York City Housing Authority. Williams have gone missing for some time, but her body was found on Saturday, July the 5th, 2024, a couple days ago, next to some trash that were due to be picked up by New York City garbage workers. My son Sam said he did um, the other day because he works in that area. He work in all them areas to see what they disposing in in the in the um, over there. And he said he did find a young lady in a bag. Officers made the discovery when they spotted a man towing a sleeping bag with an electric wheelchair. During his apprehension by the authorities, New Yorkers from the area spotted him and encircled him. Many of them had to be restrained by officers and media and medics as the crowd got instantly angry over the discovery. Why you didn't tell me, Sam? He said yes. You killed my daughter, Nicole Williams, the victim's mother, screamed as she pointed at the man according to the New York Post. He took a young beautiful girl, snuffed her out, took her life away from her, threw my daughter in the garbage bag. The whole community was upset because she didn't deserve that. He scum, Williams told reporters. So far, no motive had been released, nor had the relationship between Williams and the 55-year-old man, who as of now has not been identified by law enforcement. What is known is that Williams was fatally shot in the head, although when and where remains a mystery. Police found her decomposing body on a dolly near, near a pile of garbage bags. We honestly don't know who will hurt her. Williams' aunt, Nisha Wamidez, told PIS 11 News, She streets, she's a nice person, and she grew up here. We don't know why someone would have a motive to do something to her. Williams' family told news outlets that she had a friend brother and an eight-year-old sister. A GoFundMe page titled Justice for Yazzie, they're like a Brax doll, okay? If y'all ever watched the Brax, they got one of the dolls named Lasmin. So, so she must like the doors, Brax, okay? I do too. Justice for Lazzy was created to raise money for Williams' funeral. It reads, Lazman Williams' body was casually found on July the 6th, 2024, outside of 2007 East, 207 East 27th Street in Kibbs Bay. She was murdered and left in a bag on the sidewalk for garbage collection. Please donate whatever possible to help ensure she receives the funeral that she deserves thank you that's for me because i found my my granddaughter but i thought i didn't know it was my granddaughter okay and um i i i'm supposed to stop that stop that okay i don't know though okay like if you like to help with this case y'all can i don't do it for the fame of the money i do because it's what i love to do and to the families of these victims corporate america will set y'all up thank you peace be safe